Hey guys, welcome back. For this video, I'm going to show you how to send a video on Discord. So first, what you'd want to do is go to your file folder. So I'm just going to go to my file manager right here. And as you can see, here are my clips. And if I just want to um, paste it here, you can just go drag it into there. Or another way is clicking on the plus button here on the chat and upload a file. Click on that and go to the videos here on the video tab and once you're there you just need to click on that particular file so let me just pick the file right now right here and as you can see i'm going to go upload it right now and there you just need to click on enter just like so and wait for it to finish uploading but if this doesn't work for you, since it has a large file, I suggest that you go to a new tab and search for Handbrake. So now go to download and download the version for you. So I have this one. So I'm down to the top one. There, once you're done, just click on that. So this will help you um, make the file smaller so that you could upload it on Discord. So since I have Discord Nitro, I can upload large files. But if you don't have Discord Nitro, this is for you. So after that's finished downloading, so let me open up my file manager here. You can now open it again. So search for Handbrake. So here it needs that it needs to update or run the .NET, so just click on yes here. It will redirect you to that particular website. So just like so. And you just need to wait for it. So if it does not download automatically, just click here. But it will download just like so. There, and click on the download there. Click on install. You'll be prompt to like authorize it. So wait for it to install. Once you're done with that, go and open up Handbrake again. And once it's open, so this is what it will look like. And what you want to do here is go to the file that you want to uh, lower the size. So here I want to move this. It's the same with what I sent to Discord. So after you're here, you just want to click on Web Optimized, just like so. Now I go to the video here. So you could change your favorite, so I'll make it the same as source. And if you want to uh, lower the size, I suggest that you go to the left right here. So it depends on how big your file is. So let's say 10 to 6 would be good. And of course, you could like trace where you want to download it and stuff. And that's it. What you want to do now is click on start and code. Now I'll wait for it to like download first. So I'll, I'll pause it and wait for it to uh, be finished and I'll go back to you guys. So now it's done guys. So just need to browse to the folder there. Browse and click on save. So it's up to you where you want to download it. So it's already there, as you can see here. So let's just get back and I'll show you guys. So here guys is the original video, as you can see, when I go to properties, this is 361 MB. And when I go here, we go to properties and now it's 35. So it's basically the same video. If I go and click on it, so this is the start, and this also is the start. So that's it, guys. If you have found this video helpful, simply like below. Don't subscribe because it helps reach more people. See you on the next one.